Hey, what's up everybody? This is Flux with FluxWithIt.com and today I'm here to show you the new RF Nomad from Eviton Technologies. This is a new Eurorack module that is a single sideband radio, uh, shortwave radio in Eurorack format. And what's cool about it is the CV input on it allows us to adjust tuning through things like sequencers, LFOs, audio rate, uh, and, and just get some really interesting sounds out of this thing. Now, I'm in a basement studio, which means it's going to be more difficult for this thing to pick up regular voice communications and, and radio stations, but there's something interesting about that. And what that is, is the heterodyne frequencies that you get, the, the weird in-between sounds that you get, sound really awesome in Eurorack form. So I'm going to play around a little bit with that right now. So let's take a listen to this thing. Uh, the patch right now is running it through an SOB filter from Anamodule in bandpass mode just so I can kind of tailor the frequencies that I want to get. And, uh, and then I'm sending it into an EKO Synthrotech Echo and from there into the Music Thing Modular Spring Reverb. So let's take a listen. Now that's with not getting a single station or, or, or good solid frequency. What's really fun to do with this thing is to take it and hook it to um, either a signal generator or even just to an old computer or something and get some EMI frequencies out of this thing. So what I'm going to do right now is show you what this thing sounds like hooked up to a signal generator. So this is just an old, you know, super outdated signal signal generator and I'm just going to connect it to the antenna and let's take a listen to that.
Okay, so that's pretty interesting and all. Another fun thing to do with this is to send it back out and into itself or modulate it through other sources. So instead of modulating it from the Synthrotex Sequence 8, what I'm going to do now is modulate it from the Animodule LMVCO. And I'm just going to take a triangle out of here and let's turn it back up. Now that's no echo right now in here. This this is uh, mixed all the way dry. And no reverb. Let's bring the reverb in. Another interesting thing about this module is that you can also use it as a sort of wave shaper by sending a VCO into the CV input, unplugging the antenna, and just letting the tuning uh, be the wave shape. So let's check that out now. So we'll pull this out. Okay. And what I'm going to do is this CV input is going to be Again, coming from the Little Monster VCO, it's going to be receiving pitch from the sequencer, Synthrotex Sequence 8. Let's go ahead and pop that in there. Turn that up. And let's take a listen. We'll take the uh, effects down, so no echo and no reverb. And as I adjust the tuning, it will adjust the shape a bit. And let's drop the pitch of this oscillator. Let's try that with a triangle, excuse me, a saw wave. And of course, square.
So overall, a little bit more versatile module than you would think, and this is all without even using the um, actual voice frequencies and cool radio stations that you can actually pick up with this module. This is in a pretty enclosed space where I'm not receiving many other signals. I haven't even tried, uh, I haven't even shown hooking it up to something like a Commodore 64 or old computer to pick up the EMI from that yet. So there's many more possibilities with this thing, and I want to say that this is a very nice module. The build quality on it is excellent. Uh, the the faceplate is actually done really well. It's it's a it's like a high gloss etch kind of thing they have going on there. So it's it's just very high quality stuff, and I highly recommend uh, checking it out if you're in the if you're in the market for a really interesting, different kind of uh, sound source. Highly recommend checking it out. Again, this is Flux with FluxWithIt.com, checking out the RF Nomad from Eviton Technologies. Peace.